You must have a pretty low opinion of your old dad, son. So tell me where you got the money from, then. You know where, me granddad. And the panic in your eyes when Mum opened pot? I imagine that, did I? Come on, son. You've seen your mam, she's tickled pink. How much do the nuts and bolts really matter, eh? So you admit it. Look, my mate Fozzer had this tip. I knew it, I knew it. Don't look at me like that. It was a, a foolproof tip. It would be heartbreaking to have passed it up. Emphasis on the fool. What's foolish about giving your mother what she deserves, eh? What mum deserves is a boyfriend who doesn't lie through his teeth to her and nick her family's money. Oi, I am no thief. You need help, Dad. You've seen how happy your mum is. She's been on cloud nine since I gave her that money. Only because she doesn't know where it come from. You ever heard the phrase, the end justifies the means? Campbell's motto, is it? I did what I needed to for Mandy. You're too young to understand real love, how it gets you in the gut. The sacrifices you have to make. Yeah, a fine example I've got in you, right? I couldn't sit back and watch her miss out. She'd have been out of a job. I had one hour to come up with the good, so I stuck to what I know. Never mind the promises you've made, you know, your recovery. Once your man makes a success of that place, which she will, the three of us will be looking at a brighter future without the pressure of being skinned. Who needs to gamble? I thought it were a self-sabotage thing, you know? You only gamble when things are going really well. Oh, is that a lie as well? Listen, I spent most of my life trying to kick this lousy habit. Hey, For once, I've been able to do something good with it. And that's how Mum would see it, you think? Ah, look, is it really going to matter where the cash came from a few months down the line when she's up and running proper? If it's built on lies, yes, it will. All right, if it means that much to you, tell her. Burst a happy bubble, yeah, and risk splitting up the family and making her jobless, yes. Sounds like a, a flipping brilliant plan to me, Vinny. Are you doing it again, though? Making out like it's all my fault? No, 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 I've told you before, I don't want you to go. I want you to stop gambling. I shouldn't have lied to you. But I knew you'd think the worst of me. I need to do better, I know I do. Keep a track on this gob of mine, but I swear to you, I thank my lucky stars every single day that I've been given another chance with you and your man. Please don't spoil it. I really want to believe you. Then believe me! Why put yourself through the upset? Here is the money you put back in the pot for me, plus a couple of hundred left over from me winnings. Hey, Now, you'd hardly find a hardened gambler giving away stake money now, would you? My sweetheart, oh, you know what? I think I'm going to take a power nap before tea. Oh, that shopping has worn me out. You treat yourself, love. Hey, Stick bath on whilst you're up there. I'll bring you up a brew whilst you're having a soak, eh? I think you might be my perfect fella. What's all this mite rubbish? <laughs> Thank you. I mean that from the bottom of my heart. I still don't know why I let you talk me round. Maybe because deep down, you know it's best for all of us in circumstances. Listen, you know that money you got from your winnings? I can't, I can't just put it all back in pot because someone will get sus. So, give it back then. I'll, I'll slip it back in in dribs and drabs. It's fine. I'll keep hold of it, you know. Put it somewhere safe in the meantime, I mean. I.e. you don't trust me with it. Of hmm. course, understood, whatever you think. Not in a position to argue after today, am I? Thanks for wanting to keep me right. Now stick kettle on. 